Hello Orchid family! Thank you for tuning in. Rose here. I am in the process of repotting my uh, Phalaenopsis that just lost all her blooms. And the one with the monster roots, it's the time to start repotting the, so that those roots don't touch the Mankey media. But I wanted to show you that on the outside, the roots are looking really great. There are some uh, new, how you call it, branches. Uh, I had another one over, over there, look. It's a very healthy root. There are some dyed roots somewhere inside. Um, but uh, yeah, since I'm lazy and I haven't figured out my tripod yet, I'm so sorry. I'm going to have to clean this up and show you the results once it's spotted. Maybe if there's something creepy crawly inside, I will give you a view in the meantime. But uh, let's see if I can repot this properly in some new nice Orchiada kiwi bark. So hang on, I'll be back. I just remembered something. Uh, I just re I just placed my Pefio pedalum at the place where I think it's wanna be. But I started repotting this Phalaenopsis. This is my big white fell that lost all her flowers and I didn't know why because she had so many new roots. She was growing a leaf. Can you see that? It's a little bit greenish. That's one sea of green. Wait a sec. You see that one? She's growing a new leaf. And uh, when I wanted to unpot her, you could see that she had really nice green roots. Problem is that on top, you see those threads that's the inside that's the root the vellum completely rotted away uh, i had to rip off the bottom two leaves there was rot underneath i scraped the whole stem let me see if i can show you that no i had to scrape the whole stem scraped it uh, until i hit green because it was really black i treated it with hydrogen peroxide for 15 minutes rinsed it off made sure there was no rot left i didn't treat it with cinnamon uh, i just let it to dry then i sprayed the whole plant with fungicide um, just because she was exposed to rot so long i don't want well i have the spray for fusarium and the fungicide so uh, i thought why not uh, rather have the stomach in there that she doesn't rot away. I let her dry for two days in the uh, in the vase until I saw the roots turning silvery and uh, I just gave her a little bit of rainwater today. I made sure that the live parts of the roots, the good parts are in water. It might be a little bit too much. I will check to see tomorrow um, and hope she keeps herself hydrated like this till I figure out if I'm going to keep her in water or going to pot her up. Depends what the root's gonna do and uh, what in the meantime I learn because I'm still learning. Um, so yeah, this is the repot of my Pefio Pedalum. Actually, I have to name that uh, the unpot of my Pefio Pedalum. Ah, sorry, ha. two videos in one. This is the unpotting of my Phalaenopsis. Thank you very much. Um, I still need to repot my dendrobium. Um, she is, I'm seeing now, losing her flowers. And I already knew that. So, um, uh, yeah, that's gonna be next. Or that one that still has a few flowers left. Anyway, thank you all for watching. I love you all. Bye for now. Bye.